hi guys welcome to my channel i hope you guys are doing well in today's video i'm going to be doing a cash stuffing for the second pay period of may so this is going to be for the 25th of may and i'm going to be stuffing a total of 676 dollars so i'm going to go ahead and get started i'm just going to go ahead and count it to make sure that i do have 676 dollars in here We do have $676. So this paycheck is going to be better than last time. I did work a couple extra days. And as you can see right here, I am going to be doing two saving challenges. I'm going to be doing this Yorkie Savings Challenge. And my goal is to use this for my splurge. Um, but if I do need to use the money at the end of the year or when I'm done, filling all of these in i will use that for something else if i have to but the goal is to use it for splurging um so the way you do this savings challenge is you're supposed to roll a die and then you're supposed to um whatever you land on you're supposed to put that number in an envelope and then if you land on an icon you can choose whatever number you want or you can skip it <laughs> however i'm gonna do it differently i'm just gonna color rand pick no random numbers and color them in and then when i'm done filling all of the squares in i can go ahead and count the money so that's how i'm going to do it but um you can do it differently so i'm gonna go ahead and get started with my variable expenses okay so we're going to go ahead and start with spending for spending we're stuffing 60 dollars so 20 30 40 50 no wait, 20, 10 20 30 40 and then we're going to go 45 50 55 and 60 but I do like to do 30 for one week and 30 for the next week. So 10, 20, 5, and 30. So 30 is going to go in the back for next week. And we're going to be stuffing 30 for this week. And this is depleted because I did buy tickets for me and my mom to go see The Little Mermaid. And it was a super cute movie. I really liked it. I also bought snacks. So that's why that was completely depleted for both weeks. For gas, I'm going to add $40. Okay, so I'm going to grab two 20s. And we now have 20, 40, 60, 85, 86, 87, and 88. And I'm going to have to pump gas pretty soon. Alright, so eating out is going to get 30. And I do the same thing. I do 15 for this week. And then... 15 for next week so for this week i have 10 25 32 and for toiletries i'm going to add 15 dollars and we do have two dollars left over i do like to roll over um all of my money for my variable expenses so we have 10 15 and 17 for toiletries and i did forget to add 15 for next week so let me grab that and just put it in the back and we're gonna skip snacks so that is it for my variable expenses i'm gonna go ahead for this time and write down the balance for everything off camera just to make this a little bit more quicker Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and move on to my um, high priority sinking fund. So for 
car maintenance i'm gonna be adding 30 dollars this pay period so we now have 100 200 320 40 60 80 400 10 20 35 37 so we have 437 dollars i do want to do a um bill switch i'll go ahead and do that if i end up doing a sinking fund closeout so if i do that video i'll go ahead and switch my bills for a car i will be adding 45 this pay period 20 40 45 60 80 so we now have 20, 40, 60, 70, and 5. Our car. Emergency is going to be getting $45. And we now have 20, 40, 60, 80, 5 for emergency. When I get my first 100, it's going to be exciting. Because it's been a while since I've had money in here. Um, savings is going to be getting $60. So we now have 50, 100, 10, and 20. So that's exciting because this has also been depleted for a while. And then I'll do savings challenge at the end with the box savings challenge. So we're going to go ahead and move on to my low to mid priority sinking funds and we're going to start with black friday black friday is going to be getting five dollars so we now have ten dollars for black friday okay and then niece is going to be getting five dollars she did use well i did use the 30 for her that i had here uh, two weeks ago because I did get her a surprise like I told her because she did really well at the dentist so I told her I was going to get her a surprise and then phone um, is going to get five dollars as well so we now have ten for phone adventures is going to be getting twenty five I did use so 25 from two weeks ago i don't remember what i did i think i did something either with my mom or my niece but we're gonna end up putting 25 in here and i'm probably gonna use this again this week because my niece is gonna be staying with us for a few days so i'm probably going to want to do something with her um take her out somewhere so moving on to these sinking funds i'm gonna add 45 to health For health, we now have 100, 200, 20, 40, 60, 80, 300, 10, 15, 20, 25, 27. So I think I said 327. For vacation, I'm also going to be adding $45. So for vacation, we now have 20, 40, 60, 70, 5. Vitamins is going to be getting $5, so we have 10 now. I feel like I should have added more this pay period because I am running very low on vitamins, but um, I can either get it from miscellaneous or probably my spending. But clothing is going to get $10, and I now have 50, 70, 80, 90, 105 for clothing. Gifts is going to be getting 20. So now I have 20, 45, and 46. I do have to get my dad something for Father's Day. And then also um, I do have a couple birthdays in July. Um, so this is not getting anything right now. Uh, miscellaneous is going to be getting $10. 
and I don't know if I mentioned this in the last video, but basically I get whatever I'm gonna spend for Christmas, I get it from gifts. It's the same thing, I just um, like to divide it, but right now I'm focusing on birthdays and like things like that so um yeah and also my budget for like christmas and birthdays it's not really expensive i do like to get um inexpensive but meaningful gifts for people so that's basically what i have been kind of doing and it works just fine so we did miscellaneous and that is it for this binder lastly i'm gonna be doing my docs sinking funds Okay, so his pet supplies is gonna get five dollars. So we now have ten, fifteen, and twenty. His birthday is gonna get four dollars. And he now has five, seven, nine, eleven, thirteen, fifteen, and sixteen. And then his dog food is going to be getting 10. I did get him some dog food, so that is why I am I have less money than last time. So now I have 10, 15, 20, and 2. Okay, so lastly, I'm going to do his bet. It will be getting $50. I did dip into this because I had to get him some... That little thing um, that you put on him because it is flea season so that's why um he's a little bit low i or a little bit lower but um i'm also going to be dipping into this because he's going to be getting his annual shots on saturday and i also have to pay for his registration i already actually pulled the money out for that um which is going to be 90 dollars uh, for three years for his license which is crazy because three years ago it was 56 and now it's 90 and that's just insane um, so it's annoying, but that's how it is now. Um, so we now have one, two, three, four, five, six hundred, fifty, seventy, and ninety. So we have six ninety. I am gonna have to pull a little bit more for his shots, but I already pulled for the medication or the fee fee thing and for his license. All right, so that is it for that. Lastly, I'm going to do the savings challenge and I'm going to start with the Yorkie saving challenge. So I am going to be adding $7 to the saving challenge. Part of me wants to do the dice one where you roll the dice, but I don't know. Maybe later I'll go ahead and do that. So it has its first seven dollars and I will decide next day period how much I will be adding. Alright, so for the box saving challenge I did pick I think five envelopes. One, two, three, four, five, six. I picked six envelopes that I'm going to be stuffing, so I'm going to stuff 10. Then I'm going to stuff 15. And the last 
one of the stuff is 15 but but this is kind of gonna bug me so i think what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna change one of the fives in my spending and change it for that because i don't know it's just gonna kind of bug me so i'm gonna leave that five there and then i'll grab this Because I don't really want this to be too bulky, but it's fine. Alright, so the last one is 15. And that is it for the box savings challenge. So what I'm going to do now is that um, next pay period I will be able to stuff this again. And I'm going to be picking... Let's do five envelopes for now, and then we'll see. Three, four, and oops, five. Okay, so let me put that one back. So let me add how much I'm going to be adding in total. So we have 25, 25, 35, whoa, that's a lot, 30, and 10. I'm going to cheat and put back a 25 and grab a lower number because that's a little bit too much for me. So I'll grab this five. Um, so I think I'm going to be stuffing 105. 25, 5, 10, 30, and 35. Yeah. So I'm going to be stuffing 105 next pay period, which is a little bit better than what I picked. All right, so that is it for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you for commenting, liking, and subscribing. I really appreciate it. You guys are so sweet, and I will hopefully see you guys in the next video. Bye!